The governor of River State, Yes Nwike, has charged the Chief of Defense Staff, General Loki Irabo, to reduce the level of insurgency in the country. Citing terrorism as one of the biggest existential threats to the country, the governor said he would liaise with the Nigerian Governor's Forum to support more money to be released for the procurement of arms and other ammunition and equipment for the military to end insurgency. Governor Wike stated these when the Chief of Defense Staff and all the top military officers paid him a courtesy call at the government house, Port Harcourt. Even though you came at the time, if I will quote, the Minister of Defense said Nigeria is bleeding. I didn't say so. It was the Minister of Defense that said so. I'm only quoting him. In a sense, you have been brought in to see how you can solve the security problems in this country. No right thinking person will not support the equipping of the army. In fact, the military, not just army, the military. Everybody. Where we are today, we don't need to look back to say, look, take whatever money that's available and equip the military. Governor Wike, however, criticized what he called the misappropriation of $1 billion withdrawn from the excess crude accounts to procure arms and other equipment for the military. According to him, he wondered how anyone will expect the armed forces to fight bandits and terrorists without requisite equipment. In our own local place here, yeah, I promised them to give them five gunboats. Already, we believe the manufacturers have told us in the next two, three weeks, the one they have finished the five gunboats for the police, so the one they are doing now is for the Navy and the, and the, and the, and the Army. So they are sure that we'll give you all the necessary support. But let me comment the DGOC, even though I haven't seen my, but I can tell you the synergy with this guy's commander working with us. Anytime there's a crisis, they have always given us that uh, support. I'd like to also use this opportunity to appeal to the citizens of River State and, and those of the Niger Delta, interestingly, my original abode is the Niger Delta. I'm now a son of Nigeria, but I thought it's also necessary to put on record that it's essential for us to live in peace and harmony in order to allow socioeconomic activities to thrive. It is only with that kind of ambience created that we will improve all. I'd like to also use this opportunity to appeal to the citizens. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.